Star Walker by Mont Blanc. A 10 mil decan giveaway of Mont Blanc Star Walker. All you gotta do to enter the giveaway is like, comment, subscribe on this video, and you will be immediately entered in the giveaway. Thank you guys so much for watching and good luck. Hey, what's up guys? It's Josh here. I just wanna do a review today on Mont Blanc Star Walker. The main like Mont Blanc fragrance that is hyped is Mont Blanc Individual. It's supposed to smell like the, you know, the fabric softener. Highly hyped, very versatile scents, very solid scent for me. That's the only scent that I've purchased. One of my subscribers, or actually a few of them, were just ranting and raving on my comments video and saying that they get the most compliments with Star Walker. Star Walker is their favorite fragrance, blah, 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 blah. I'm like, all right, I gotta try it at least once. It's about a $20 fragrance. I'll pull the trigger, sounds good to me. When you look it up online, the main note for this is bamboo. You don't see too many bamboo style fragrances at all. I know Hollister has something called Icy Bamboo and I actually do kind of like that style of scent. I've never smelled anything to my knowledge that has bamboo in it. Bamboo is the number one fragrance note for this scent. To me, what does it smell like? Light and woody. I mean, honestly, it really comes down to that bamboo note. Do you like it or do you not like it? Because you get that bamboo note the entire time all the way to the end. So it really comes down to a little bit of personal preference. To me, when I smell it, you know, fresh, woody. This came out in 2005, I believe. And this really, really reminds me of fragrances that come, came out in the mid 2000s. As soon as I smell it, I could picture taking getting taken back to that time period and smelling somebody with you know that has been wearing this if it was going to excel in any situation it's going to excel in the office in my opinion very very just good office and i don't know how it's going to compare to something like prada loam or something like aqua di show profumo so we'll see how that goes you know a little bit more in the future i don't know i don't want to say i love it i don't want to say i don't like it but I'm kind, of, I'm kind of in the middle for now. You kind of will have to see how it goes in the future if I get compliments, if I like wearing it in the future for work, things like that. But anyways, guys, a very, very, very solid set. If I were to give it a rating, I'd probably give it about a 7.5 for now. And for uh, projection longevity, probably also about a 7.5 right in the middle. Nothing really overly good or bad to say about it. I don't know. If I get this weird feeling that I'm going to get a compliment with this fragrance, I don't know why. I don't get that feeling very often. So this kind of, it honestly comes down to personal preference. Do you like that bamboo note or not? It's a very light woody scent. It's a very solid scent. It's been Josh TV. Let me know what you think of Mont Blanc Star Walker. Have you tried it? Have you not tried it? It is very, very hyped fragrance. So I expect a good amount of people to to try it for me i'm kind of on the fence with it i i can't pull the trigger and say it's something i recommend to everybody at this point but it's very solid very good for the office very cheap can't really discount it you know too much more than that but anyways guys it's been josh tv thank you guys so so much for watching i appreciate it so so much like comment subscribe if you enjoyed the video i'm having a great day out here hopefully you're having a great day at home i'll see you on my next video I'm gonna talk about the, the giveaway real quick. I forgot to talk about it. Fly, let me just finish up the original video. All right, um, just be like, all right, so.